This is Natalie, and it's time for yet another YC Weekly. There's a huge event coming up in the United States that hasn't happened for decades. The next total solar eclipse. For all you non-space nerds, the moon is going to block out the sun on August 21st. For around two minutes, depending on where you are, the only sunlight we'll see will be from the sun's atmosphere, making beautiful ribbons of light. Before you get too excited, the total solar eclipse will only be visible in certain parts of the U.S. The event passes through a certain line called the line of totality, so unless you're on its direct path, you'll only be seeing a partial solar eclipse. At least everyone in the U.S. will be able to see this one. If you're looking to find the best places to see the eclipse, NASA's website has an interactive map. It lists where the eclipse is headed and what time it'll happen for all the saints. Since we're talking about the eclipse, I guess we may as well go over eclipse safety. Don't look directly into the sun. It may sound obvious, but some people think it's safe to stare at the sun when it's covered by the moon. It's not. It's not safe. In order to look at the sun without damaging your eyes, make sure to wear glasses with specific solar filters. You can also use a filter on a telescope if you want the best way to watch an eclipse. And really, why not get the best view you can? The next time we'll get another total solar eclipse is in seven years, so it's definitely an event people go all out for. Why not? Why, why not? Why not? Why not? All right, y'all know what time it is. It's time for the traffic report with your boy Malik Carlton Henry. What, what? There's going to be traffic everywhere. It's going to be here. It's going to be here. It's probably going to be where you are, too. That's a lot of traffic. So you might not want to drive the day of the eclipse. Even if you're just going for groceries, it's going to be backed up, especially if you live near the line of totality. Then you're just... What are you going to do? You're going to walk everywhere is what you're going to do. That's the solution I'm giving to you. So that's not a day to be on the road. There will probably be a lot of accidents. You're not going to be able to get anywhere anyways, so just stay safe out there. That means you all, you punk skateboarders, don't cause any trouble. You know who you are. <laughs> anyways, you're going to want to be getting to these spots to view the eclipse like a week early because everyone is going to be fighting for them. And now for the weather on the eclipse, it's going to be nice and sunny, except it's not going to be sunny because the moon's going to block out the sun. And this is your weather and traffic update brought to you by Malik Henry. Remember, if you can't view the eclipse, you can always live stream it. Perfect for shut-ins to enjoy nature without leaving the comfort of their basement. Nerd. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's all for this week. Remember to like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter and Instagram, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. I hope you've enjoyed our double dose of the YC Weekly.